Watch as the man with a hoodie at the center of your screen casually touches women as he walks by. Jessica was one of them. I picked up a phone call and within, I don't know, 30 seconds, I felt this arm come around me and I just thought it was my boyfriend. Her boyfriend and his friend were walking a few feet behind and watched as the man grabbed her butt. The friend then pushed record on his iPhone as the suspect continued to grope women. Yeah, he touched you, he touched every girl on this block. I'm getting him on camera. According to witnesses, the man kept reaching out, out in the open on a busy stretch several blocks long along Queen so Street West you. in broad daylight. Witnesses claim they watched in disbelief. No one seemed off limits. It wasn't just a single woman. There was a woman with her, with her carriage with her baby in it, and he groped her. Another woman with her mom. Actually, uh, the last woman that he touched it was three women. It was a mom and her two daughters. Just grabbed her now. She's turned around. I asked her if he She's with her husband. Yeah, and I asked her, too, and she totally says yes. Hey, yo, he, did he touch her? Yeah. And all along Queen Street, people were calling the police. Fifteen minutes later, police arrested this man. A 26-year-old resident of the area, Lamech Williams, was charged with sexual assault. He's being charged with five counts of sexual assault, but police believe there may be more victims. This man was known to police. He was in breach of recognizance. The allegations are quite concerning, and uh, th that's all I can speak to. For sexual fetishes, even if a person's been arrested time and time again, and they don't want to do it, I've worked with clients who say they just can't help it. Those who've worked with these kinds of criminals say escalation is always possible. If it's a psychosis, all bets are off. Anything can happen. Literally anything could happen. The reason I was not paying attention at all is because it was broad daylight. I was on the phone. I mean, my guard was down. And there were dozens of witnesses everywhere. I mean, this was Saturday afternoon. You know how packed Queen Street gets. Um, the guy with the iPhone actually followed this guy for at least six blocks and he was just groping women with strollers, teenagers, and he was worried that he would go out and, and grope a child. Luckily, mm. he didn't. Bottom but, uh, line, police say it's a crime, and if it happens, you should report it. Yeah, a lot of women think it's, it's not a big deal, but absolutely, and it could escalate. Thanks, Mina.